Hello, anyone and everyone. Welcome to uh, Ed Troll channel update. The, the day is the day is the um, time of day when it goes up. Not time of day. The day. I'm not sure exactly when this is going up. Uh, maybe Thursday. So maybe no, or maybe maybe Tuesday. Shoot, I almost said a bad word. Shoot, but uh, don't call it a comeback. We've been here for years, obviously. Um, I actually just, uh, recorded a, uh, heartfelt, I mean, uh, me explaining what happened or where I was and I realized I didn't record. So just, just like old times, I haven't, I haven't skipped a beat. I haven't, I haven't changed that one bit when it comes to this whole recording thing. Uh, yeah, so we haven't uploaded in like a month or two. Uh, I was just, uh, again, because I already just sort of explained it and I feel like an idiot for it's hard to be like give a genuine heartfelt thing twice in a row I feel like I, but, but we're gonna be honest as we always try to be um we haven't up been up uploading because uh I was in a bad mental space for a while uh and let alone we were also extremely busy we being me I have been uh working two jobs uh trying to save up money get some money to move out and I didn't want to upload until I was out of my uh, mother's house you know bless her heart the uh, willing to like take me in the stuff so yeah I've been I was planning on uh try uploading as soon as I moved out or rather as soon as I got set up at a new place but uh when your credit's not the best it's hard to find places obviously but I I also uh you know I've I've been offered by some friends they offered to like let me stay at their place for a few months but then uh, you know it's like I move in there for a little bit then by the time I moved in I'm already gonna have to be looking for a new place so you know I, I and again I appreciate the offer greatly but it's also yeah I, I don't think they're gonna watch this video side now that so it's not like I'm like trying to like be subtly like tell them through a video it's just uh. Yeah, not explaining it. Um, we also, uh, yeah, the two jobs, you know, working from like seven to seven or eight to like, I told them at the minimum, I got to be out of here by two. Not at the minimum. I had to be out of here by two so I can like go home and change stuff and then go to the other job at three. And uh, so, yeah, so like seven or eight to two and then three to like, 10 30 to 12 either or you know one of those times <laughs> and uh so i've been kind of busy if i get off early at the other job i usually just take a nap in between jobs so that's why a lot of uploading has been going on um i've i i i think what i want to do you know obviously I, there's a few games that i have in mind for you know, re coming back to uploading, uh, I have them up on uh, another on my other screen, like on a bunch of Google Chrome tabs. Google Chrome is this sponsored? Do you know it? No, yeah, right. Um, I I, I think I want to try and maybe do content like that. Uh, I don't know when or how I'd be doing it. Maybe just be like these are games on my wish list that I'm trying to do, or I'm looking forward to doing, or thinking about doing, and then you guys can comment and be like, oh wow, <laughs> oh wow. You could comment and say if you were interested in seeing a particular game be played or you would just be updated on games that are coming out. You know what I mean? Because I try to uh, keep an eye out on games because I'm a loser and that's all I do besides watch anime and work. Um, One eternity later. I remembered. So I, I, I'm, I'm definitely adding out that long period of thinking in between of where the hell I was going with that conversation. Uh, I don't know what the uploading schedule will be like. Um, like before it was, you know, it was on a, a relatively set schedule. So it was easy to try to keep track of when I was uploading. But now it'll be like definitely I'll upload on Thursdays, maybe Tuesdays, maybe Mondays, you know, whenever I have a spare day. Uh, this will probably come out on Tuesday, ironically enough, but, uh, yeah, Thursdays I definitely will have off, so I can definitely try to get a video out then. Uh, it'll just be harder because, you know, the whole two jobs, but I'm staying up late all the time anyways and not getting sleep, so I might as well upload, right? 
Right. Yep. What do we do if we're not constantly doing something? Being alone with our thoughts, and that's terrifying. Man, I look so fat. Did I gain? Did the? I have to watch some old video and see how much weight I gained. Um. So yeah, I think I want to just like maybe we can just right now. I'll show you the a few of the games that I want to upload onto YouTube. And uh, yeah, again, you can comment and be like, "Hey, this looks good. This looks bad." This looks good for the channel, or boom, add it to my wish list. Let me know what your thought of these games are. And I don't know if I'm going to make an edit or I'm just going to pull one over onto the screen. It's a, it's a new process. All right, yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. Let's do that. All right, bite on my face for now, maybe. First up, Eastward. Welcome to the charming world of Eastward. Population declining, journey through a society on the brink of collapse. Discover delightful towns, strange creatures, and even stranger people. With a trusty flying pan and mystic powers on adventure into the unknown. Published and developed are published by Charcoalfish, developed by Pix Pixel. This game coming out September 16th. Looks extremely fun. $25. The art is gorgeous. Apparently, it's about uh, humanity has been driven underground and nature is taking back humanity. And we get the, our unlikely duo has to figure it out and save humanity. Uh, ooh, pardon me, an action, an action RPG, an action adventure RP, uh, RP, an action adventure that looks delightful all through and through. There's no never here. Just you, me, and the rest of these maniacs. <laughs> Bring it, baby. Deathloop is a next-gen FPS from Arcane Leon, the award-winning studio behind Dishonored and Dishonored 2. In Deathloop, two rival assassins are trapped in a mysterious time loop on the island of Black Reef, doomed to repeat the same day for eternity. Essentially a... similar to a Hitman slash... Dishonored vibe where you're in an open island, an open world, exploring the island, looking for your targets that you have to assassinate, and you have to assassinate every single target before the whole loop goes through or it resets, starting you back to zero. It seems Hitman combined with a little roguelike, and we like that on this channel. It uh, comes out September 14th, 2021, so it's coming out by the time you see this video, obviously. It's a, a full price $60 banger, which is so, it's his, uh, something we're normally nervous about but it just looks fun uh, word to the wise apparently it is based off of steam reviews at the moment it seems like it's not the most uh, optimized game but we're gonna try and run it on the channel possibly so good luck and this game looks like a blast over people and so is rambling frank the rest of you motherfuckers are next this 
skateboard. Grind on bendy straw, kick flip over staplers, and carve killer lines through cardboard and sticky tape parks. Blah blah blah, skateboards try their best. Skateboard seems like an adorable uh, reimagining of the old school Tony Hawk game where your goal is to uh, amplify your score and get it as high as possible by just comboing trick after trick. But you also get to be a silly bird and cause complete chaos. Comes out September 16th, 2021. Uh, there's no price on it so far on Steam, from what I can tell. But I am definitely excited to try this one out. And uh, screw around and make some cool escape, escape moves as a cute bird. <laughs> Flynn, son of Crimson. Help Flynn and his mythical companion, Dex, save Rosantica before the, the, the evil from the Scourge claims his home. In Flynn, son of Crimson, you go on a journey of discovery and conflict as you learn to master the power of Crimson Energy. It comes out September 15th, 2021. Developed by Studio Thunder Horse, published by Humble Games. Unfortunately, there's no price that appears to be on, on it right now for Steam. But needless to say, we are excited for this action platformer. Yeah, so I lied about the face thing. Sorry. I hope you don't get too upset with that. Regardless, uh, here's some Final Fantasy XIV footage. Uh, what I would play late at night whenever I would get home from work. This, uh, let me know in the comments down below if, uh, this, if, was, if you like this format, uh, the test run format I did of, like, upcoming games or games I'm looking forward to trying to record. It doesn't necessarily have to be upcoming games. It could just be games that, hey, check out this, uh, these games on Steam or something like that. Let me know if there's any, any of those games particularly, uh, st struck, st uh, took your fancy. Like, either in the sense that you want me to play them or you want to get them yourself so you can play. Either one's acceptable. I would love to hear about it in the comments down below, of course. Um, thank you for coming back after my unstable uh, uploading schedule. That's been two months. Uh, I love you guys for coming back. I appreciate it, and especially if you made it all the way through this video. Uh, we'll see you soon. Bye-bye.